Hey. Holden, thank God you're home. Lily, what is it? Is it your mother? No. Your kids? The kids are fine. I, I'm so sorry that I had to call you back from your business trip, but I didn't no, know what no, else to do. It's okay. It's okay. We're wait, especially if something's wrong. I thought that I could handle it on my own, but... Well, what is it? What, what couldn't you tell me over the phone? Luke's been expelled from the university. I'll come get the rest of my things later. I never figured you for the cut and run type. Are you kidding? After all the times you called me coward? Right. My mistake. Well, I'm not running now because I can't deal. Then why are you leaving? Because I don't understand why winning at all costs became more important to you than anything else. Oh, yes, yes. Of course. I didn't feel bad enough, so thank you for that. You tried to steal the election. I had my reasons, Noah. And one of them was you. That's a lot of bull. I was standing up to hypocrisy. Kevin. Whatever. I guess we just see things differently. Since when? Whatever happened to standing up for each other, no matter what? I really believed in that, but I guess... I guess all bets are off when the going gets tough. You really don't get it, do you? There's got to be more to it than that. Did he say anything? Did he give you any explanation or anything? He just said he had to win. Why? I don't know. Honestly, Holden, I was so angry. What about his dreams? No school is ever going to take him now. How could he just throw away his future like that over a student election? I mean, that he didn't even care about it until a few weeks ago. And now to get expelled over it. What has happened to our son? I don't know. There's only one way to find out. Come on, let's do it together. I, I totally get it. You are a better person than me, and you're punishing me for it. I am not. I wish this wasn't happening. I tried to talk you out of it, remember? I remember how morally superior you sounded, trying to prove you're not your father. What does that have to do with my father? Because he taught you to see things in black and white. Good versus evil. There's no gray areas with you guys. There's no gray area on trying to steal an election. Okay, it sucks. And if the other side had done it, you'd be all over them. Well, could you have at least thought about my reasons? There's no excuse. Why don't you understand that? Because I'm a power-hungry lowlife. End of story. You better dump me before it rubs off. Uh, that's not fair. What's not fair is getting me kicked out of school. What's not fair is ruining my life. I was asked a direct question. I had to tell the truth. Why couldn't you just trust me just this once? You were caught. Okay, you weren't going to get away with it. So you saved yourself. Forget love. Abandon ship. You're, you're right about one thing. My father, he lied to me my whole life. And I don't want to be that. He did a lot of unforgivable things in the name of love. I mean, if you remember, that was his excuse for almost killing you. There is no comparison. There is for me. I love you, but I'm not going to lie for you. I'm also not going to encourage you to be anything less than the person I know you can be. I thought I could trust you. Yeah, I thought I could trust you. I guess we were both wrong. with me, but I had my reasons. Mm, that doesn't really justify cheating, though, does it? I would have made a much better president than Kevin. I would have set a new tone on that campus. I would have gotten rid of the discrimination that people pretend doesn't exist, but actually does. I'm sure you would have. And then Noah just ruined it all for me. No, Noah did the right thing. <sighs> yeah, for him. How did it help him? You know what? It's it's complicated. But just trust me on this one. Interesting choice of words. You know, I can't, I can't do it. Hold on. You that. cannot go through life deciding what's right for people and then just forcing it upon them. What was going through your head, Luke? I mean, you had to know you weren't going to get away with stealing an election. You have to know you did the wrong thing. 
I do. Good. That's the first step. Now you need to fix it. How? You need to take responsibility. Own up to what you did. I'm already humiliated. Why make it worse? I just want to move on. And throw away your education? Your mother's right, Luke. You haven't done anything like this before. You have good grades. I think expelling you was a bit extreme. Yeah. You know what? Forget the dean. I'm going to go talk to the chancellor. My family has given a lot of money to owe you over the years. We should be able to work something out. Like what? Like you buy him a stadium and I get to graduate? Luke, you make amends and you get yourself back on track. Thank you. Is that what you want to? Yes, Dad. I want to go back to school. I'll do anything to get it. You're sure about that? Yes. So you're willing to let your mom's money bail you out of trouble? No. The usual? I don't want any coffee. I just need to talk to you. I'm working. It's important. Please. Hey, can you uh, cover me for a few? Sure, man. But uh, if we get slammed. Yeah, I don't have a lot of time. All right. I'm sorry. What I did was... To... I'm just so sorry. Where's this coming from? My parents came to see me. And just the look in their eyes. They were so disappointed. It killed me. Yeah, I know that feeling. No. This wasn't like what you got from your dad. Because you didn't deserve that. I brought this on myself. True. I I'm, I'm sorry, but it is. I just wanted them to to yell or, or to make this about them. But they didn't. There was no drama, and that almost made it even worse. It was like, what have you done with your life, Luke? When did you become such a greedy, selfish excuse for a human being. Whoa, they said that. No, no, they didn't say that. They were just... They were just really worried for me. They told me that I have to take responsibility for what I've done and that I have to fix it. And I'm trying. Well, any ideas on... No? No. But I know I can't do it without you. Will you please come back to me? I'm not perfect. Nobody is. I can be a complete jerk sometimes. But, but I'm paying for what I did. I can't change what I did, but I'm trying to make it better. Isn't that good enough? I don't know. <laughs> well, you're not perfect either. I am not looking for perfection. Gabe, what happened with Kevin in the past... I told you all about that already. Uh, the facts, maybe, but... He really did a number on you. And you're not over it. That is not true. I'm sorry, Luke. But you've got some serious issues with that guy who happens to be a complete jerk, by the way. But you acted even worse than he did. And until you figure out why, I don't think we can be together. <laughs> I'm sorry, I've got to get back to work. Hey, Luke. Hey. Hey, we were just talking about what happened, man. You, uh, you totally had a raw deal. The dean really kicked you out, like, permanently? Pretty much. Dude, that's just not right. Sorry. Thank you. We just came from Kevin's victory party. He won't make half as good a president as you would ever. Mm -hmm, but at least we got some free beers. <laughs> you, uh, you care to drive no, 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 us? Luke doesn't drink. I do now. Uh-huh. Wow! <laughs> 